next level fitness guys so this is going to be my saturday check-in uh if you didn't know i'm doing a 12-week transformation challenge it was supposed to be part of a boot camp that was running on my site but i decided to just kind of do it on my own and then when i go to run the boot camp again at least i'll be able to show you results and progress from following a program for 12 weeks or a program that i've made for 12 weeks okay so we are two weeks in and uh i started out and my weight on my scale at home was 242 um at the end of the first week that read 233 um a more accurate scale i have at work is called a tanita scale excuse me and on that one um at the start my weight was 238 and at the end of the first week, it tied at 233, which is kind of odd. Um, so week two, uh, check-in. Uh, this week, not a ton of weight loss, and that was to be expected. Uh, there was, There's always going to be like an initial weight loss uh, when you first start. You know, you're not consuming as many carbs, drinking more water. Uh, you're going to have like a big water weight drop, and... That initially was, is what the uh, first week, week and a half was. So now, still going to continue dropping water, but body fat uh, is going to start dropping a little bit more now too. Um, so now, going forward is where I expect to see a lot of difference in my, um, not that I haven't seen any body composition start to change. Uh, so yeah, anyway, this week's weigh-in. Um, I thought it was great, even though it wasn't a lot, so... If we're going by the scale at home, it re this morning it registered at, this is after fasted cardio, registered at 232.6, um, so basically roughly a pound. Um, the one at work, after my workout, um, I weighed in at 230, so I'm going to go by the one at work. Um, but yeah, no, um, definitely still feel positive about it. Uh, getting all my workouts in, my strength uh, is great. It's starting to go back up again. Um, and that those would be the positives from the week. The negatives would be, and I explained it in the last video too, it was WrestleMania weekend, Saturday and Sunday. So I had ended up having like a uh, cheat meal with my brother on Saturday and then again on Sunday. And then the rest of the week, pretty clean. So um, if I want to attribute, you know, my... I didn't lose a lot more weight. I probably attribute it to that. But, I mean, honestly, it's no big deal. Like I said, still food positive. I'm still on track. And uh, excited to see what this week uh, has in store. So, uh, you want to continue following along with me. Hit a like and share the video. Um, I think at the end of this, I'll put up, like, my weight from... The scale at work this morning so you guys can like see the difference and that one it's a little bit easier as it's kind of labeled um from last week to this week okay so uh see you guys in the next video all right so to need a scale check-in this week uh last week april 10th 233 that's on standard this week april 17th 230 and on the athletic setting same thing 230 body fat percentage seems to have dropped from last week if we're going by the standard and last week this week is 32 last week was 34 and on athletic it says 23 last week's athletic i think said 26 so uh definitely changes happening i was hoping it'd be a little bit better this week but i mean all in all so went well uh and that this is just to show, you know, don't get caught up so much with the numbers that you forget how good the week went uh, with all your other stuff. So all my workouts got in, didn't get injured, felt great. Strength is uh, still going up. So, yep, still a positive week. All right.